<laughs> Chico! <laughs> and what are we getting married under like a freaking thing? What the hell? <laughs> Today we have a special video. We're gonna be eating at Teresa's parents' restaurant mm -hmm. for the first time. T's dad is gonna be making some lobster sticky fried rice. Mm -hmm. This was one of my favorite dishes growing up. My dad used to make it for me and Kevin all the time. So now I'm excited to show you guys how to make it. And then Kevin, Zach, and me are gonna be enjoying in front of you guys. But before we start the video, if you guys are new to the channel and you haven't subscribed yet, mm -hmm. make sure to subscribe right now. Do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Huh? <laughs> Teresa's ball after eating gobby <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> All right, this is my dad, Chef Leon, and today we're gonna make fried lobster sticky rice. No, my chow long, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Straight with the <laughs> raw hands. Wow. Oh my god. Wow. Okay, get a go out. Sanjay. Sanjay. We're gonna use three lobsters today. Hi Kevin! Hello! Are you gonna join us and eat? Sure! Sure! First we're gonna add some cornstarch. Oh yeah. Technique! Technique! Wow, that's a lot of oil. Now we put the lobster in and fry it up. This is three lobsters, it's gonna be a lot of food. These are all the ingredients for the sticky rice. We got some fried taro. Um, this is like Chinese sausage mix. Some green onions. The best part, some noodle crisp. We're gonna add some oil again. Now we're gonna add the lobster mix. Now we're gonna add a little bit of the egg back in. Then let's add a fried taro. Time for gluing this rice. <laughs> Now let's add our egg yolks all in. Let's add the fried lobster back in. <laughs> I can't, I can't. Look at the knee! She bad, she knows she said. She bad, she knows she said. She bad, she knows she said. Kevin wants to try. I'm gonna try it. See if I got the inheritance. Okay, okay. Let's see the flick of the wrist. Let me see it, Kev. The wrist don't flick. Wait, it's because you're not putting the knees into it. Let me see the knee action. Alright, Zach, let's see it. Some yum yum. Yum yum going in. Oh yeah. Then we're gonna add some fish sauce. Come go. Oh more than that? Okay. Fish sauce going in. Now let's add our green onions. Going in. Then the crispy noodles. Going in. I'm gonna let my main man mix right there. Not me. Uh uh uh. <laughs> we're gonna add a little bit of dark soy sauce. Just a little bit, get that color. There we go. Oh. Now it's time to plate. Here we go. All Lobster right. sticky fried rice going on. Damn. Oh my gosh. That looks crazy. Yo, I don't know how he's holding that right now. That smells so good. Wow. Yo, we gonna, <laughs> we gonna body all this? It's gonna be lit. We're gonna need some help. And there you have it, lobster sticky fried rice. Let's eat. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Ah, you go order long haul on Wi-Fi. Oh man, that was pretty good. <laughs> That's lit. Yo, this thing's heavy as hell. 
all the food is done right here. We have so much food. There's no way we're gonna finish this. We're gonna need a lot of help. Mm -hmm. Your parents didn't eat yet. That's crazy. I know, they they've been working so all today. day, all night. Everybody eat this though, right? Yeah, yeah, Okay, yeah. okay good, good, good. Kevin. Yo. Yo. Oh. Her dad also hooked it up with some quinto guat. Quinto guat. Sweet and sour pork chops. Everybody's favorite. All right, okay, let's make plates. Yo, check out that piece of lobster tail. The sticky rice and the lobster. Look at that lobster tail. Oof. Guys, check out that first bite. Careful. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's oh, <laughs> All right, let's eat. This is foil. Can we cheer some more rice? Can we do a rice cheers one more time? Mm hmm. Cheers. Damn, okay, Kev, smaller rice. Cheers. Side. Mm. It's a, I feel like the trial phase needs to be about two, three months. What mm. do you say, Kev? Mm -hmm. Two, three months? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Everything's running smoothly. Mm -hmm. To get the momentum swinging. Swinging. Eyes closed, just swinging. Swingin'. Remember the YouTube series, Songs in Real Life? Mm. Remember that? With yeah. The white, white dude, Steve? Yeah. Bro, he was goaded. You see that lobster right there? Eating the sticky fried rice right off the shell is way more flavorful than others. Oh, for real? Best, right? Yeah. See, you gotta make this dish one time without your dad even in the kitchen. Do you think you can do it? I'm not gonna lie, not possible. How many more times do you think you need to watch your dad do it before you can do it? First off, because the walk at home just doesn't have it much, just doesn't have as much like walk, hey, mm. you know? I can't make it happen. That is strong. So strong. Every time that turns on, I go like, ooh. I don't know, I don't think I can make this. Or it won't taste as good, you know? Do you think that you can make it in this kitchen though? But if you make it a lot less though, mm. maybe. Dang, I think Ryan Garcia lost. Already? I don't know. I didn't see. Yeah, yeah, yeah he lost. While we're eating right now, super late at night, I'm watching the Ryan Garcia versus Tank Davis fight. Crazy. History in the making. If you guys ever come to this restaurant, you need to try the sweet and sour pork chop. It is the best. There you guys go. Look at that glistening sweet and sour sauce and the crunch. Cheers. Oh, okay, sorry, sorry. Oh, what the hell is that bone? Cheers. Cheers. Mm. That makes it the best. These two dishes and shrimp and mayo are my favorite dishes at your parents' restaurant, hands down. Imagine we had shrimp and mayo today also. We should have just waited. Yeah, we should have just waited. We were right there. Next time, they will be on next, next time. time. That's exactly what, <laughs> that's I'm, that's saying, what I'm saying, yo. Yo, Kevin, are they going to do line dancing or not? Yeah. Kevin's so excited for that. You're going to line dance? Mm-hmm. He went to go buy his drumsticks and his like pants, lion dance pants. <clears throat> oh yeah, did we rate it yet? Mm -mm. What do you say, Cal? No, it was McDonald's 24 hours. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you wanted to say? <laughs> I think so. Yeah. The one by us is. No, it's not. If it was at 3 a.m., 4 a.m., come on, we know that. That was during COVID. Yeah, true. Let's rate it. Kevin, would you like to rate first? Sure. The lobster for me, 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10. Yep. And then the, um, the sweet and sour pork, uh, yeah, that's a 10 out of 10. Oh, giving out 10 out of 10. That's a 10 out of 10 for sure. Mm. All right, for me, the lobster fried rice, I'm rating it 9.6 out of 10. Sweet and sour pork chop, 9.5 out of 10. Two 9.5s. 9.6 and 9.5. Oh, 9.6. Yeah, yeah. Nah, this, this one's better. I haven't had this sticky rice in so mm. long. For me, I'm just like caviar. The lobster, 9.5. But this quinto quite 10 out of 10. That 10 ass. out of 10? That ass. That's what I'm talking about. The crunch on that. Yeah. When it's fresh out. Not many restaurants can make this. Mm -hmm. It is good. You go eat, you can have it every, they have it everywhere, but it's not. It's not the same. No, yeah. it's really not the same. What part of the lobster is your favorite? Mmm. The tail. Tail. Hands down. Yo, the claw. Really? No, <laughs> it's like. Hit claws. Because <laughs> it has, a, it has like, a, like a weird bitter taste to it. I don't like it. I don't know why. And, and just, it's just so satisfying looking at a perfect like claw oh, meat. Pull it out. Yeah, mm. like a perfect claw meat and you bite into it, bro. It's like, you know. I ain't gonna lie for that's me. That's <laughs> For me, my favorite piece is whichever one has the most rice attached to it. Oh, wow. Oh, you don't want that? You can take it. No, I'm just kidding. Oh. Then you're being nice to me. I'm not used to that. What? What? Here you go, Kevin's. No, thank you. I don't want to go back to Texas. I want to eat this every day. Can you imagine that? What? Your dad moved to Texas, opened up the restaurant down there. Ew! 
I've been told them. I was like, Dad, you should open a restaurant in Texas. They need one of you guys. They need one of these. Yeah, he was like, no. Well, I don't know the Texas stuff. I'm like, you don't need to know it. Your food just gotta be good. Trust, you'll get business. Mm -hmm. If this video gets a thousand likes, Teresa's dad will open a restaurant in Dallas. <laughs> All right, guys, we finished eating. Food was amazing. I'm decently full. Ate a good amount. But uh, yeah, we're gonna be eating here a lot more. <laughs> if you guys have some time, check out the restaurant. It's Canton Manor in Bayside, Queens. We'll put the address in the description down below so it's easy for you guys to find. Check it out. With that being said, we're coming to the end of the video. Hope you guys really enjoyed it. T, do you have a special word of the day? If you made it to this point of the video, make sure you comment down below the word, Papa Leon. All right, comment down below the word, Papa Leon. This is the end of the video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Peace.